Hello everyone, Daniel Yuck here. Thank you all for tuning in today, I appreciate you. Today we're gonna to dive into an in-depth review and an unboxing. We're gonna take an up close look at this tattoo machine from a company called Dragon Hawk. This is going to be the Mass Tour Pro Rotary Tattoo Machine. This is gonna be the T1 Wireless Power Supply. I will leave links for you in the description below so you can check this out on your end. We're gonna be diving into an in-depth review. We're gonna be wrapping, testing out the performance, taking an up close look at the machine everything in between should you have any questions at all at any point throughout this video i'm going to encourage you to drop a comment down below i will do my absolute best to assist you in the best possible direction with that being said let's dive straight on into this where i would like to begin is by showing you all the tattoo machine up close and we could check it out with the wireless power supply so this is the box right here that the rotary came in and again this is the mass tour pro right here very straightforward, simple box. I like to show you all everything to digitally put you in front of the product here. As you see under the hood, we have foam and then a cardboard like insert that may have an RCA cord. We'll get there here shortly. As you see, we have the machine housed right there in foam so you can ensure your investment is protected along the way. Here we have O-rings and there is an RCA cord as you see right here. So we do have the option to go ahead and go standard power supply and or wireless. This is going to be RCA input. The stroke on this machine is going to be 3.6 mm. I will leave links for you in the description below so you can read about all of the specs. For this video, I'm gonna go ahead and put you right in front of the product. Allow me to move this over so we can get a better view at the machine. I'm gonna zoom it in here. So this is the Mass Tor Pro. So as you can see though, the size of the machine is actually really small. However, this one is a bit different. As you see, it does have an LED rim right here. So when there's power going into the machine, it does light up, which is different there. And then as you hear, it is a click grip. And it is of a, I think, aluminum or a metal construction. It has a metal build to it. For those who are curious, removing the grip like so. So if I'm correct, we can autoclave the grip. For this, we can just simply wipe everything down for sterilization purposes. As you see though, this is a short pin style tattoo machine. So this is the tattoo machine right here. Allow me to get the wireless power supply right here. And this is going to be the T1. And to apply, as you see, it's one, two, three. You can see the light there. Very smooth, very consistent. It has a nice balanced feel in my hand, especially when I add this power supply and how it kind of just goes straight up. This right here is a nice balanced setup right here. Me personally, I do have experience with the Mass Tour Pro, and this is a well-rounded tattoo machine. If you're looking to line, shade, pack, it can all be done with this machine right here. I would like to get into wrapping up this machine, and I want to show you all how I go about doing that.
So here we are, allow me to conclude this video and give you all my final opinions and some insight on the Mastor Pro Tattoo Machine. Again, I will leave links for you in the description below. If you are needing another tattoo machine, if you're just starting out and you're wanting a good, well-rounded, affordable tattoo machine, I would highly recommend checking this one out. For the price point, I believe right now it is on sale as well. It is definitely packing a punch. I am able to line. I'm able to shade, I'm able to stipple, I'm able to push bigger mags, I'm able to pack color, pack black, you name it. Anything that I need to do, all of the essentials and fundamentals that I typically do within my style of tattooing, I'm able to achieve with this machine. For me, in terms of performance, it's definitely there. I'm definitely giving it a thumbs up in terms of performance. I'm definitely giving it a thumbs up in the price range as well. You can get uh, this machine by itself or you can get the bundle with the T1 battery. Again, I will leave links for you in the description below. I would highly recommend to check it out. Well-rounded tattoo machine. Now, the only drawback that I would say is is to my understanding I didn't find any information on whether or not this part of the machine comes apart I'm certain that we can remove this part of the grip right here and for that I do like because I can put this into a bag autoclave this I can code sterilize it I can code sterilize this as well again my only issue though for those who are tuned in with my channel would know that I really like to disassemble and be able to kind of get in there with a q-tip and get all of the crevices and nooks and crannies for me that's my approach and I enjoy that sort of approach I feel safer with that approach I would definitely give it a four out of five and a thumbs up this machine definitely packs a punch as I'm able to do all of the essentials within my tattooing. It's easy to set up, easy to use, it has low vibrations, definitely cost effective, well worth checking out. Now, if I didn't touch base on anything specific that you may have wanted to know at any point throughout this video, I'm going to encourage you to drop a comment down below and I will do my absolute best to assist you in the best possible direction. I also have social medias all under the same name as this YouTube channel. I have Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok all under the same name. I would truly appreciate your support on there as well. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for me and ring that bell as I will be bringing more videos like this for you all. Thank you for tuning in yet again. You have a great day.